What do you think is the value of the expression 3 plus 6 divided by open parenthesis 6 minus 3 close parenthesis 10 times 2 to the power of 2? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? At first glance, this question looks very easy, but it confuses almost everyone. Let's dive in and break it down step by step together. Many people to solve this question first go to the expression 3 plus 6. And instead of this expression, they write 9 divided by 6 minus 3 inside the parentheses, then times 2 to the power of 2. In the next step, they go to the expression inside the parentheses and simplify this expression to 9 divided by 3 times 2 to the power of 2. Then, they perform the division between 9 and 3, and instead of this expression, they write 3 times 2 to the power of 2. In the final step, they go to the expression 2 to the power of 2, and simplify this expression to 3 multiplied by 4, which ultimately gives them the answer 12. Then, without any hesitation, they quickly say that option D is the correct answer to this question. But this answer is absolutely wrong. Also, some other people to solve this question first go to the expression inside the parentheses, and instead of this expression, they write 3 plus 6 divided by 3 times 2 to the power of 2. In the next step, they go to the exponent 2 to the power of 2 and simplify this expression to 3 plus 6 divided by 3 times 4. Then, they perform the multiplication between 3 and 4 because they believe multiplication has higher priority than division. So, instead of this expression, they write 3 plus 6 divided by 12. In the next step, they perform the division between 6 and 12 because they say division has priority over addition. So, they simplify this expression to 3 plus 0 0.5, which ultimately equals 3.5. And immediately, they conclude that option B is the correct answer to this question. However, that's definitely wrong. Now let me show you how to solve this expression properly. As you can see in the image, in this expression, first we have an addition sign, then a division sign, followed by parentheses, then a multiplication, and finally exponent. To solve this problem, we must follow the PEMDAS rule. In this rule, P stands for parenthesis, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. We must follow the order of operations step by step from top to bottom. Okay, we we'll start with the parentheses first, because parentheses have the highest priority compared to the other operations. So, instead of this expression, we can write 3 plus 6 divided by 3 times 2 to the power of 2. In the next step, we go to the exponent, because exponent after parentheses has higher priority than the other operations. So, this expression simplifies to 3 plus 6 divided by 3 times 4. Alright, now it's time to perform the division and multiplication, because multiplication and division have higher priority than addition. However, we must pay close attention that multiplication and division have equal precedence. In this case, the best thing to do is to start from the left side of the expression performing the division and multiplication as we go. So, we start with the division between 6 and 3, and instead of this expression, we write 3 plus 2 multiplied by 4. In the next step, we go to the multiplication between 2 and 4, because multiplication has higher priority than addition. So, this expression simplifies to 3 plus 8, which ultimately gives us the answer 11. Therefore, option C is the correct answer to this question.